Um, this is the first question Jillian asks. Um, why is that most film school graduates never get hired as a filmmaker? Well, perhaps because most film schools don't teach um, their students how to make good films. Um, it's really misplaced emphasis. You know, I went to two film schools myself. I have nothing against film schools. But um, uh, there is something fundamentally wrong with the system. And um, let me just elaborate on this. 90% um, um, of film school stu students and even graduates are obsessed with technicality. I was. Um, camera, gear, sound gear, lenses, lighting, equipment, um, 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 special effects, all of that. I'm not saying camera is not important. Camera is important. Sound is important. Um, all these different technical aspects of filmmaking, um, mm, they're important. But when you have a story to tell, when you have something to say, without that, they're not going to help you. And, um, you know, the emphasis um, at film schools, most film schools, 90% um, of the emphasis should be on um, finding the idea in you, finding the story within you, helping you extract it, develop it, structure it, um, turn it into a three-dimensional story, and then film it organically and authentically. Um, instead, that is not the focus. Um, this is 5% of the focus if you're lucky, 3% of the focus if you're lucky. The rest of it is on technicality. So I would say a lot of um, film school graduates um, come out of film school unprepared. And they spend, you know, $20,000, $30,000 off their savings on their first short film. Um, and, um, or, you know, their parents' money. And I've seen this firsthand. And, um, you know, they get the best camera in the market and they hire the best people in the market. Um, and But, you know, really their story sucks. Okay, there's nothing to watch. People go to see movies because they want to know what happens. They want to see a story. It's all about storytelling. Once you have a story, once you have a good story to tell, then spend the time, um, spend the money. Uh, on uh, technicalities, get the best camera, the most suitable camera and the best sound gear and the best lighting and the best technicians and the best locations and the rest. Um, but if the story doesn't work, then nothing else is going to work. I remember, um, you know, um, about 20 years ago, I was at a film school, a film uh, festival, and I met this uh, very interesting um, Armenian film director. Um, he had made a film and the film was um, being screened at the festival. Um, it was superb, technically. It was amazing. Like the camera work, the colors, um, uh, mise-en-scene, um, particularly the camera movement. It was so interesting that I invited him to lunch because I wanted to know, to learn how he had done some of his scenes. But as a piece of drama, Okay, as a film, as a story, it sucked. The same film. It was a torture to watch. It was an exercise in what I call um, artistic masturbation. By the end of the film, I was the only person left in the theater. And this is something that I told him, actually. He didn't really like it, but I was very honest with him. But technically, it was superb. So he had spent millions of dollars... He told me that he worked with four great cinematographers. These were A-list cinematographers. And he had fired, hired and fired three of them because they could not, um, you know, get what he wanted. Um, very elaborate um, 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 work, but for nothing. It was like a postcard that didn't say anything. It looked nice, but it was empty. There was nothing, nothing behind it. Um, so that is, that is um, in my opinion, that's the vice. It's um, um, misplaced um, emphasis and, um, and wrong focus. And that's why a lot of film work, film, filmmakers, at least I know film students, film graduates, um, um, film school graduates, I think 80%, um, 90% of um, people who go to film schools to become directors um, never become directors. It's it's um, uh, the percentage is really um, mind blowing. It's um, it's a huge failure on that part. So that's my opinion. I think 
uh, if film schools did a better job focusing on what is important, we would um, see a much higher success rate.